pretty much a guarantee of some rain. Day three, two great days previously. Third day, weather's a bit changeable today. We're gonna climb to about a thousand feet, I think, up near Aviemore. It's gonna be cold, wet, but it'll be good fun. Two days before, really, you know, rest set us, set us up, pulled us together. It's a couple of good nights. I also had a very good day yesterday afternoon because I had the opportunity to go and watch Caledonian uh, Thistle against Comorna. Unfortunately, Comorna lost, but it was good fun. Uh, so here we, uh, here we're ready to go. This is going to be a tough day today, but we're enjoying it. We are day three of the ride. We're in the comfort of the uh, of the minibus. As you can see from outside, we've got the wipers on. We've got quite a bit of uh, quite a bit of rain, and just up ahead, we we can't see the top of the mountain. Uh, we haven't caught up with the riders yet this morning. They've been riding about an hour, uh, so I can imagine they're uh, just getting into their rhythm, albeit a damp one today. And uh, as soon as we catch up with them, we'll, uh, we'll be back. Well, you can see what the weather's doing, but, but this is why we come to Scotland, isn't it? Uh, what breaks my heart more than anything is I've just ridden past the biggest patch of chanterelles I've ever seen in my life. You were tempted to stop? Uh, I was extremely tempted to stop, but uh, I didn't have a bag, I didn't have a knife. So how am I feeling? Yes. Well... Wet, my throat is knackered, um, but the views are lovely, grey, misty. Um, I don't think I've ever driven across here, let alone cycled across the A9, along the A9 in Taiwan in quite as miserable conditions as these. Because normally, if I was heading up here, I'd be going climbing, and if it was as bad as this here, I'd just turn around and go. Unfortunately, that's not an option. So. 